Sunflower cutting. Open, open. Oh my god, you're spending it. Fuck, bloody tear. Spending it here, Penny. Look at this. Spending it, bloody tear. Get out there. You are not a painter, I'm the artist to you. you. Just get all in a mess. Okay, get out of the picture. I just went to Cuba in November. Uh, for the last 13 years, I've been back to Cuba. And the thing I see in Cuba, me remind me all these places or the third world, um, it's a mixture of European, it's a mixture of South American third world countries like Peru, Argentina, and Brazil, a little bit of Rome. Uh, it's like the equalization of the whole world regarding human resources, poverty, education, uh, the economy, the thing that people have to do to survive. I was in Cuba in November, and I went from Havana, Trinidad, Guantanamo, Baracoa, all across Cuba. And it's absolutely unbelievable uh, the way that the thing that we convince ourselves than is democracy, how the new wave of economic influence from China, uh, uh, the replacement of the communism and the capitalism by corporation, digital company like Google, Apple, and Facebook. These are the, p the future of the world, the new power, the new empires, and it's very fascinating. Uh, in one way, I say fascinating, but I will say boring in many ways. Uh, for example, Havana, the girl with the dog, uh, remind me the the place in, in the center of Rome, Roma in Italy, where it's a dog sanctuary. A difference from the dog or the sanctuary, who is more like a citizen and trying to help uh, the community. In Cuba, it's more like an economical trick in order to survive. Uh, the music, for example. Every, every, everywhere you, ho go, you go, you could hear Buena Vista.
Uh, I born in Cuba uh, in November 1958. Um, I live in the UK for the last 30 years. I have been living half of my life in Cuba and a half of my life in the UK. I now live in Wales, but when I went to Cuba, I am not criticizing the Cuban to do what they do best. Uh, what I'm trying to comprehend why is the future, what will be the future of Cuba regarding uh, the situation of the world today, regarding the economy. I do believe that Cuba, the Cuban, they are the one who really run in the country. People who live in Miami, Cuban, there are about 2 million or 3 million Cuban living around the planet. And when you work in, in Cuba, you see that the whole country is being run by people who own those American cars. They have been restored with excellent quality. Um, uh, the paladar, uh, the, the taxis, everybody is struggling to survive. And that is really uh, fascinating to me to watch. The government do seem, but uh, with the difference with China, I never been in China myself, but according to what I know so far, the Cuban people, they are the one who will bring the island uh, afloat, economical. But I do believe that with the expense, to the expense of, uh, with the denigration or many value than I, I should hold it very dear to my heart. I hope you enjoyed the video and I will carry on with this meditation.